So, friends, it's time to get lit. It's time to get lit. Oh, this candle smells so good. And I hope that I could actually smell it while it's lit because I got candles from this candlefish store, which I did an unboxing recently. And I literally can't smell these candles. And no, I don't have COVID. <laughs> Um, this happened to me last time I ordered candles from them. Like I really like their candle scents a lot and their packaging is really great and the company is really cute and great. And they're like a local company to South Carolina, North Carolina, wherever in Carolina. And I really like their candles a lot and I wanna like them a lot. And I've ordered from them multiple times and this actually happened to me last time I ordered from them. I had to ask for an exchange or a return or a refund because I'm burning these candles and it's an hour later and I'm like, what does that smell like? It smells like nothing. <laughs> it smells like absolutely nothing, which is really unfortunate because I really like the scents of these candles. It's the end of the workday, time to take the sock off. What that smell like? Probably just lost that sock forever. Uh, dolls kill. Treat your motherfucking self. I needed some clothes. Yes, I needed them. So I decided to order some stuff. So let's open the clothes. Yay. This week at work has been pure insanity. I recently became a manager this week, which has been really fun, but I feel like I am like, this. is this what it feels like to become a mother? <laughs> no, not even close, but it is a lot of responsibility and a lot of work, but it's been really great. Uh, very cute. These are like bike shorts, but they're cotton material. I thought that they were gonna be like that kind of material that you get with running clothes. That's kind of like dry fit sweat, sweat wicking material. Oh my God. Oh, I thought I wasn't recording for a second. <gasps> I'm like so tired right now. I feel like I could take a nap, but I'm trying to, I'm trying to rally because it's Friday evening and I haven't done anything this week after work because I've just been so exhausted. But I really like these a lot. Uh, it kind of has these acid patterns. So it kind of looks like maybe like I shit myself a little bit with these, but it's like neon goo. So alien shit all the way. What that smell like? These are gonna be great. I actually really need gym clothes. Everyone at my gym shows up in these like put together outfits and also wearing like just a sports bra and little tiny shorts. And I'm like, Damn, you bitches are like half naked up in here and working out in these tight ass little gym clothes. And I'm over here wearing like a baggy t-shirt from like five years ago and sweatpants that I've had since like 2010 and old gym sneakers, just like gross and sweaty. And they're all like cute and like lifting their little weights. And I'm like, hoo, hoo, hoo. but it's the gym. Who cares what you look like, really? I don't understand people who like wear makeup to the gym and stuff like that. I like wash my face before I go to the gym. Faux showsies. All right. What else we got in here? Oh, this is really cute. Ooh, I don't know if I like this material though. Actually, it's not that bad. Just definitely cheap but I bought a lot of stuff from Doll Skill that was like super cheap. This was like probably less than $10, but it's cute. I love cherries. I have a cherry tank top right now, but it's made out of this even shittier material than this <clears throat> that causes like piling those little tiny bumps on clothes. Here, I'll show you. When I was picking this shirt out, I'm like, do I really need another shirt with cherries on it? Yes, yes I do. Pop my cherry. <laughs> See this material, how it has like gross bumpy stuff all over it. This is my old cherry shirt. Upgrade, got an upgrade. Whoop, pretty cute. Ooh, yes. I got an Easter outfit. Well, it's not like technically an Easter outfit, but it's Easter colors, very spring. I 
was into. And it's from the Ragged Priest. Ragged Priest, A plus quality. And A plus like design aesthetic. Like look at the inside of this collar. Quality. Ignore my ratchet nails. Uh, yeah. Love this. Minus the fact that it doesn't have the checkerboards on the back, but it is like embroidered and sewn. So it's like super high quality. So I get that they wouldn't put that on the back. And then it comes with a skirt. <laughs> skirt, skirt. Mmm, I see. I see why this was on sale because it doesn't have anything in the back either. Why you do me like that, Ragged Priest? Still cute though. I feel like it's still cute. It is like a pretty thin material and it looks like it may not be super tight on the waist. So I don't know if it's totally gonna fit and be great, but it is cute at least. I was really excited about this skirt. This skirt feels so summery and like a picnic on a breezy sunny day. Really cute. Just imagine wearing this with like a black crop top or like any kind of tank top. Ooh, and it does have a zipper, which is good. Cause I'm like, this is a tiny waist. I don't know how I'm gonna get this on without a zipper. It's not like stretchy material either, which I like. And I kind of like the shape of the ruffle. How it like curves like that. Very summery, very cute. And I actually really like this tag too. Sugar Thrills. Doll skill. Kind of reflective. Yes. I got this like slip dress. So I kind of like wearing stuff that sort of looks like lingerie, but isn't. I clearly like plaid, clearly. But I feel like this would be really cute with like some boots and maybe a bun. I like the lace around the top and it's just like a simple, oh, okay. It has like a lacy slit on the leg. Wah, wah, wah. Yeah, I can't even smell this candle. More workout gear. Yes, this is actually a skirt that I can wear to golf. I literally have one golf skirt that I wear every time I go golfing with my family. I'm like, let's change it up and get a second skirt maybe so you're not wearing literally the same thing every time. It was only like $12 or some shit like that. So I was like, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Oh, this is a wild choice. I was going through the sale section and basically just getting like a lot of the weird shit that, I don't know. I feel like people wouldn't really wear, but me, I was like, I can pull that off. I feel like a lot of times people are like, I can't pull that off, it's so weird, but you pull it off so well. And I'm like, just put it on your body and it's done. But this is like this polo shirt midi dress, but it has like these different patterns and it's long, so I'm thinking I might actually cut it if I don't like it, but I feel like this would look badass with a pair of docks and like, I don't know, maybe a mesh shirt underneath it. I thought it just looked cool. It's just kind of all over the place. <gasps> I'm so excited for this. Literally, I feel like everything I have is either plaid or stripes, clearly. This dress from the Ragged Priest, Scarecrow Queen. I love this so much. It's so cool. And I actually like how this one doesn't have any anything on the back. It's just like plain black on the back, but all of these are separate pieces of material that are sewn together. And it's like really high quality and it's actually fitted. You could probably tell more from the back with the black color, how it like cinches at the waist a little bit. Super cute. This is gonna be so great to wear to work. I always need new work clothes, especially now that we're getting back into the office. I'm like running out of things to wear and I'm wearing weird shit like this to the office. I'm like, you know what? I'm just going all in with my goth vibes to the office on the Friday and hope that no one cares too much. Oh, and we got one more shirt from Doll Skill and then I'm moving on to Urban Outfitters. This is 
super cute, super tiny little shirt. It's like a little halter top that ties in the back. This was like, I think like $6 or something really cheap like that. But I just need more of these like tiny little shirts to wear when it's hot out and I'm just vibing, going for a walk. Going out, going out on the town, you know? Okay, moving on to Urban Outfitters. They can fit a lot of stuff in these tiny packages. Yeah, 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 fitting stuff into a tiny package, you know. They really know how to stuff it in. Okay, I was worried that I wasn't gonna like this color, but I kinda do. It's this like magenta purpley color that I don't normally go for, which I feel like is kinda great because I don't have anything this color already, so it'll like kinda match everything because I like to like wear stuff that doesn't totally match. As I say that, I'm now remembering that I got an, an outfit that's entirely pink to match this, but I just really need shorts, like, especially now that it's getting hotter out. All my shorts are like five years old. And these seem super comfy and cute, and I really liked the thick, stretchy waistband, like ultimate comfort, but it's also this like denim material that looks like a little bit more structured, even though it is super soft denim. Like this is like nice wash denim. And then also the bottom is frayed, but it's also stitched at the hem. So when you wash it, it's not gonna like fall apart immediately, which is great. Which is great. It's so great. But yes, I got socks. I always need socks. And last time I got socks, they didn't fucking fit me, so I had to give them to my boyfriend. I'm like, you're welcome, free present for you. I like how I'm like, I'm so tired, I'm falling asleep, and I'm opening these, and I'm just like, ah! Uh, Polo Ralph Lauren socks, so I'm gonna be a bougie bitch with my bougie toes. This, these are some nice quality socks. I just really like socks. I feel like if you have a new pair of socks, it can like revamp your entire outfit. Look how cute these are. This, with this, I know that it doesn't match exactly, but like these shorts with these socks, really great. Really great. Oh, I'm so excited about this. I've been thinking about wearing this all week to work, but I've been controlling myself because I'm like waiting for a good day to wear this at work when I have a whole bunch of meetings so everyone can see me and I can be like, mm, mm, look at my designs and look at me wearing this cool mesh dress. Yes. Obviously I would wear like a tank top and pants underneath this. I'm not gonna like just wear this to work, but like love this so much. I can wear this in so many different ways. Okay, first of all, this mesh material, great for like a beach cover up or something like that. Also because it's like a thousand degrees out at all times in Florida. So really great for that. Also the fact that the bottom has this slit at the bottom. So I can wear like jeans or maybe black pants underneath this with a tank top to work. And I feel like it'll give me like this sleek silhouette outfit that I'm wearing, but like, it's just gonna be so great. And I also like that it's this fishnet material and not like actually mesh, like this is mesh, see-through mesh. I feel like this material can sometimes be a little bit sweaty and gross in hotter weather. And this is like super breathable and super comfy. Um, I'm gonna look like a trap queen. Yeah. Moving on to the next bag. I like this blue packaging with this like black grungy material. Your like pattern. I like it. It's like the mix between the light soft pastel color and like the grungy texture. It's a good mix. It's like spring, but still hardcore. Oh, every time I open stuff, I'm like, I completely forget what I ordered. So I also wait a long time, like I'll order stuff. And then I got all this stuff like a week ago, but I purposely wait a week because 
let's be real, if I don't win, I'm just gonna wanna order more shit eventually. So it like hypes me up a little bit. Cause I'm like, I know I have the stuff, but I'm like, I'm not gonna wear it yet. I'm gonna wait. So it's like, it prolongs the inevitable of me wearing this stuff and then like getting over it and wanting to get more stuff. So it's like, hopefully it takes me longer to buy more stuff. Cause shit's expensive recently in this economy. Uh, this is real great. This material is super warm, so this will be great for like winter months, but this was literally like, I think like $15 or some shit like that. It's just this like little cape. It's like a blanket cape, which I actually will probably bring this to work because it is freezing in my work office. Like literally this is gonna be me designing. <laughs> yeah, this is great. And it's great that it was so cheap and I'm definitely gonna have to fucking uh, lint roll myself now. And I really love this ring, but it always gets caught on everything. This like little barbed wire ring that I have. I have to like hide my face for this to zoom in. Nope, not zooming in. Uh, okay, what else do I have here? I thought I ordered more stuff, but it could be on the way. Oh yes, I also got this pink shirt to go with The pink shorts and the pink socks. It's like a monochrome, but they're all slightly different colors. I don't know, I kind of like that. Like it's not all exactly the same color, but it just matches as an outfit. <sighs> well, thank you for watching me open my stuffed packages.